everyone, and welcome to the Stanley Cup playoffs with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro in just a moment. I'm Mike Emmerich, and here we are at the beginning of it all. Whether you won the division or whether you just barely scraped in, you're here. That's important. What do you say to your team? Well, let's control what we can. Uh, you're right, Doc. Home ice being a visiting team doesn't really matter. At the end of the day, is that you have to control what you can how you play, how you compete, and this is what it's all about. It's the best time of year, and we've seen over history teams that have won the conference have gone on in the Stanley Cup. We've seen teams that finished in eighth spot have gone on and won the Stanley Cup. So it really doesn't matter. As long as you give yourself a chance when you get in, anything can happen. Just looking around this building, Doc, you know there's a sense of excitement. It's a long road to get to the Stanley Cup final, but this is where it all begins, and everybody is certainly jacked up for this. Let's look at the starting netminders. This man's the goalkeeper tonight. The book on him is that he can be rattled with an early goal. Let's see how he does tonight for the home team. This man's the starting goaltender tonight. Some nights go better than others, but most of his nights are superb for the visitors. Rowled it again. So now a penalty will be handed out. Slovakia is given a minor here for tripping. I'm going to give credit to the puck carry here. He kept his legs moving. He forced the back checker to reach in and take him off his feet. Well, we can only hope that the game picks up in pace here. The teams seem to be feeling each other out a little bit. And what's really happening is the puck stays in the middle of the ice. He covers and holds on. This is frustrating. The goaltender makes a save by getting just a chunk of the shot. Quick work on the faceoff. Score! Welcome to the playoffs, young man. That's the first. There's not one facet of the game that this rookie hasn't shown that's in his toolbox. He's been on the body, he's shown some skill, he's made some nice plays, shot the puck really well. I've liked this game. That is the first goal scored after a lot of work. Great start, they were ready to play and it shows on the shot clock as well. Solid win at center ice, now what? And so we've been on the receiving end of more than a few of these things. This is why you retire from the game. What a gorgeous hit. Under nine minutes played in the first. It's a 1-0 game. Good faceoff win. Score! That's his first playoff goal. I love watching guys score on the back end. Man, that's a quick shot. It catches the goaltender by surprise. He's not set at all. A face-off win. Let's see what develops. Trying to get something generated up the wing. That rush is broken. Shoots wide. Wonderful chance. Puck grab. They've got it ready. Sends it across the blue line. Slovakia is finding its way to center. Flings it. You can almost count. Score! Callis gave the goaltender no time to react with that quick snapshot. It looked to me like he had stopped the shot. He had a big chunk of it, but it worked its way into the net. J. 
just a little over four minutes remaining here in the first. The lead has just been cut in half. Let's see if there's a shift in momentum. Russia's collected another victory on the faceoff. Russia's in possession as they travel along the boards. Tries to get it on net. Oh, what a save that was. In the first period. A backhand shot. Got a piece of that one. Puck covered, whistle blown. I don't know how much of this puck he stopped, guys, but it was just enough to keep it out of the net. Slovakia is carrying it up the wing. Two guys together with force. Big force. That's a physical brand of hockey. And he hammers one. The first period has come to an end. We're here in a tight game. These two teams are separated by just a goal. Please don't throw any objects on or towards the playing surface at any time during the game. The throwing of any object... Slovakia's got the lead at the end of the period, and their goaltender has made a huge difference in that. Here's just an example of his body of work. We'll be right back. Dropped in the clock, moving in the second period. Slid to Shepard. One timer. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a face-off right near it. Big face-off win. Let's go, Arister. What a save. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. You got to find a way to put it in the net. Score! The rookie connects in the playoffs. First time. You sure not playing like a rookie tonight, is he, Doc? He's been on the body. He's been showing his ability to handle the puck and move it around. He's had a terrific evening. Team Russia's got the game even up again. Still in the second period. Lots of time. Can't wait to see what happens now. And they take that neutral zone face off. Can't seem to find a play there, so he'll go back and reset. Fires a shot. His first playoff goal. You want to score goals, especially off of rebounds? Go to this area. And so everybody's headed north. The puck turns around and heads south back towards the goal. The goalie just can't handle this shot. Slovakia has broken the tie and gotten back ahead, and we're still in the second period. Should be fun just to get to the end of this one. Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. Enormous collision. I wonder if that hit will change the momentum of this game. Takes a shot. The Russian is organizing back in their own end. And in flight over the line. Asked what? Star! A rookie, first ever in the playoffs. Each rookie feels comfortable at a different time in the season. Some guys never get it until late in their first year. He's shown that he can contribute in several different ways. He's shown skill, he's been on the body, he's gotten himself gritty. I've really liked the way he's played. Slovakia's goal has given them a two-goal lead now, and there's still a lot of time left in the game. We're still in the second period. Held to the glass. Scrum over, puck kicked. Forty minutes have been played here, and still more to go. A well-deserved rest is at hand. Fans, take a look to the sky. 
The home team Zeppelin is loaded with prizes and in your way all intermission long. Slovakia's insurance goal has staked them to the two goal lead that you would expect them to have. Here it is one more time. We'll return after these words. We are entering the third period. Based on the first two, what are you expecting to happen? The Russians have had the better of the play, Doc, especially in the category of time of possession. They're down in this third period, but they have to start finishing off some of their chances. On to Nakas. And a save. And he's hammered. Knocked to a knee. Lost it. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. And he gains the zone. Let's it go off his glove. Close in play. Score! His first playoff goal. What a great memory for him. Kovalchuk's first step was the right one. He got to the front of the net and received the pass and put it in on a one-timer. The goalie thinks he's got the bottom half of the net covered. Obviously, he doesn't as this goes by him on the low stick side. Russia's deficit is only one because of that last goal. Let's see if they can tie it up here in the third. And they won the faceoff. Slot shot. Score! That's his first playoff goal. With the goal scorer right in front, it was tough for the goaltender to pick up the shot off the backhand. A lot of times the goaltender feels like his positioning is perfect and he's got the net covered. Guess what? He doesn't. Russia's third period goal has tied this game, and there's still plenty of time to go. Plus, the momentum seems to have gone to them. Good reach there. He knifed it away. The draw, the tie up, and his team prevails. Good pass up that left wing, and he's got it. One team is going to be short from this. Let's see what the call is. Slovakia is only going to get two minutes on this call, but it was tripping. Now, this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck, but he tripped up the attacking player. Referee over to the penalty box, and let's find out. Slovakia has been assessed a minor penalty. Two minutes, and the call is tripping. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. Russia is setting things up through the neutral zone. Play is stopped. There is a signal. We just wanted to see who it is he's taking off. Slovakia is sent to the box for two minutes. It's tripping. Oh, this is clearly a tripping call. He made no attempt to play the puck and took the legs out from the attacking player. Yep. Gets in, and he'll look over his options. To the slot. Outstanding save. What magic even to get there and get the shot off. Just over eight minutes to go in the period. A hockey game is one of lead changes, and this one has seen its lead vanish. Good faceoff win. The Russians power big time save, big time shooter. Good quick poke check there. Oh, here's a chance now on the giveaway. Got it right back. Drives it. Why? I don't know how that one timer missed the net. Out to the point with it now. That's the way to make him pay. Could go left, could go right. Pick the wrong way. That's a big hit, boys. Real Score! Welcome to the playoffs, young man. That's the first. A 
Oh, this has been quite a night for him. He's had his fingerprints all over this game. He's been on the body, he's shown some skill. He's gotten to the front of the net. I'm really impressed with what I've seen from him tonight. Slovakia's gotten the lead here, breaking the tie in the third period. What a raucous ride to the finish we're going to have now. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. You win that, and you don't have to chase. They chase you. All right, he's going to the bench. Roll the dice. Slovakia is in control of the puck along the side. Offside stops the clock. Russia's calling its timeout now to try to get this game reversed. This timeout will include instructions for where people need to be, but it starts with the execution of the faceoff, and the coaches also want to make sure that if they don't win it, everyone knows what the best plan is to get the puck back. What a hit! Oh, that's a great hit. He's trying to spark his net open. No! Gotta get it on net.